The annual Battle for the Bell game invades Cal State Fullerton as a sold out crowd of 10,000 fans were on hand to witness two undefeated 8-0 teams collide. It's number four Fountain Valley taking on number one Edison. Edison quarterback Matt Biles finds his receiver Dylan Leaner wide open in the first for good yardage. This would lead to a 47 yard field goal from kicker Marcus Trujillo and the Chargers go up three to nothing. Later, Viles tries to hook up with Jeff Trojan, but the pass is broken up by Austin Wynn. Edison would score another field goal. In the second, Davion Orfe busts loose for major yardage before he's finally taken down. He rushes in for a two-yard score shortly after, and it's 13-0. Fountain Valley struggling to get anything going on offense. They fumble the ball, and later Middlebrooks is swarmed by an aggressive Edison defense. Coach Ship on his team's performance. It's a simple game. We're making it hard right now. Our defense is playing outstanding. They've been on the field most of the game. We got to get it done. It doesn't get any better in the second half for the Barons as Charles Burke sacks quarterback Dominic Raglan. Edison takes over on downs, and Davion Orfe picked a great night to have the game of his life. He eludes tacklers for a 40-yard pickup. Orfe runs it in from five yards out, adds a two-point conversion to top it off, and we have a blowout on our hands, 21 to nothing. It gets worse for Fountain Valley. This should have been a pick six, and later, one of their five bad snaps leads to another Burke sack. Edison would go on to win the game and defend the bell. Yeah, I started off kind of nervous, but I started getting into a groove, you know. I noticed that their defense started giving up quick, and I just started going power and powering up. Uh, it's nice uh, not to lose the Fountain Valley four years uh, I'm here, but uh, yeah, we're excited. Well, I was only here for four, but uh, <laughs> we're excited. Our defense played great tonight. Our offense did some nice things. I mean, we moved the ball, we ate up the clock, ate up, you know, got kept their offense off the field. You know, we ran the ball a lot better than we did last week, so. Um, you know, they're a very good team, so, you know, any win's good, but definitely 24 nothing special. Edison holds on to the bell for the fifth straight year, defeating Fountain Valley 24 to nothing. A shutout victory where Edison dominated every facet of the game. Edison wins at least a share of the Sunset League title, but there is some bad news. Matt Viles was injured, and it took him a while to get off the field during the game, but it turns out that it's not too serious, so hopefully he'll be on the field next week as Edison takes on Marina. Reporting from Fullerton, I'm Jonathan Camus for OCVarsity.com. Hey, you guys are the champions! Let's